Hey everybody, Adam with Front Range Storm Contractors. We're here at our home office. Just want to tell you really quickly about our new program that we just came out with a couple of weeks ago. It's our roof residential roof maintenance program. Okay. Now, some bigger companies offer maintenance programs to their bigger commercial clients, but I want you guys to be able to take advantage of what a maintenance program can do for your home. All right. So. Um, there's going to be four levels of service, bronze, silver, gold, platinum. The bronze level, uh, basically we're going to come out twice a year in October and April, or uh, depending on what month you actually sign up for, um, that might change a little bit in the first year. But then after that, going forward, it'll be April and October. You can pay for it when you sign up. You can pay for the whole year in one shot, save a little bit of money that way, or you can uh, pay for it monthly. Um, either way, you're getting way more value than the actual cost to you, okay? Um, the first level is just going to be where we come out, we take pictures of the entire exterior of the home, um, windows, siding, gutters, roof, paint condition, everything. Then we'll take it home and we'll um, mark it up with, circles and arrows to highlight the different things that we want to point out in those pictures I'll create a report for you on some software that we've got email that to you and then you've got documentation as to the condition of your home um, and insurance companies tell you um, that the best way to document what's in your home should there ever be a fire or a theft or anything is to take a video of all of your contents this is exactly the same thing, but for the outside of your home. So it's a huge value there. And I'll get a little more into that later, um, especially for you uh, if you've got an executive home, really large, really expensive, something like that. So stay tuned uh, towards the end. I'll explain why that's so important. Uh, but our next level uh, is going to include some uh, minor repairs with that. And then if you have either gold or platinum levels, we're going to go ahead and uh, clean your gutters. And it's also going to include some priority scheduling should you have any kind of leak or hail damage or something like that. It'll include some level of uh, repairs for free. Um, we'll do some emergency mitigation at no cost to you. So there's... A lot of different benefits to these. Um, email me at adam at frontrangestormcontractors.com and I can send you all the details about it. Or you can text me at 720-724-1515 to request some information. Now, the reason that this is so important, even if all you get is the bronze level, is because right here I've got on our whiteboard what it costs to replace some types of roofs. So if you've got asphalt shingles, oh, and unfortunately, I didn't write this looking in the mirror. So this is gonna look a little backwards to you guys. So this says asphalt shingles, and they range from 500 to $600 for 100 square feet of replacement costs, okay? Most houses are gonna be 20, or 2,000 square feet to 4,500 square feet. Um, now remember, this is per 100 square feet here, so we call that squares, okay? So 20 to 45 squares is gonna be most roofs with asphalt shingles, but that's coming out to $10,000 to $27,000 just for the roof, all right? Then you've got another kind of material called woodruff, which is like a faux wood. It looks like wood, but it's really not. It's going to be about $700 per 100 square feet to replace those. Most of those houses are slightly larger, 30 to 45 squares. So you're coming out at $21,000 to $32,000 for a cost to replace just the roof there. Now, wood shake roofs themselves are going to be $700 to $800 per square to replace them. Most of those are going to be 30 to 100 squares. It's a pretty big house. But they, they do exist out there. So that's going to be about $21,000 to $80,000 just to replace the roof only should it ever need to be replaced. 
if you've got a metal roof, and that can be what looks like kind of corrugated metal, it's called standing seam, or it can be there are metal tiles, and some of those metal tiles even have the same type of granular covering that asphalt shingles have. Okay, so there's different types of metal roofs. So that's going to range generally from $800 to $1,000 per 100 square feet to replace those. And the size of those roofs are going to be 30 to 100 squares. So you're talking $24,000 to $100,000 just to replace the roof. If you've got concrete tile roof, um, those are starting at $1,000 a square. Some of them can be, I've got, there's a glare, but $2,000 or more, depending on the brand. Ludoichi squares, extremely expensive. So those are also going to be about 30 to 100 squares per roof. So you're looking at 30000 to $200,000 just to replace the roof if it's damaged with hail. Now, do you really think your insurance company wants to pony up all that money? So the more expensive your roof is, the harder they're going to fight to not have to replace that roof, okay? So, wood shake, metal roofs, and concrete tile roofs, if you've got that on your house, your insurance company is going to, for sure, hire an engineer to come out and try to tell you that there might be damage on your roof, but it's not from something that your policy covers. It's not from hail, it's not from wind, it's gonna be foot traffic, installation air, uh, especially on concrete tile, they're going to try to pump, uh, pass it off as what they call con um, expansion and contraction damage, you know, heating and cooling cycles. It's just not true. There are all kinds of videos on YouTube that you can Google about testing how hail damages concrete tile. And basically, there's a little corner, let me see if I can, a little corner down at the right lower corner of the tile that is the most susceptible to damage. And when hail hits right on that corner and breaks that corner off, your insurance company is going to try to say that that just happened because there wasn't enough room for it to expand and contract. Well, if you can manually just shake or jiggle that concrete tile, there's plenty of room for it to expand and contract. But there are videos out there showing one inch hail damaging concrete tile and they're going to try to tell you that it takes softball size hail to cause any kind of damage. So if you have documentation of the condition of your roof that there were no problems before the hailstorm, then you get a hailstorm and you've got 30 or 40 of those concrete tiles with a little piece that's missing, chipped, cracked off, something like that. Then they come and say, nope, sorry, that's, you know, expansion, contraction. I say, really? So it all happened between, you know, the end of April when my contractor took pictures of it and the middle of May when the storm came through. So two weeks there somehow, all these tiles just, no, I'm not buying it. And then they come around and they go, oh, you have pictures? I guess maybe we'll have to pay for it then. So... You can see how this would be extremely beneficial for anybody with an expensive roof just to ensure that their insurance company is going to do what they promised when you pay your premium every month. Um, it's extremely cost um, effective for you and uh, give us a call or text us at 720-724-1515. Send us an email, adam at frontrangestormcontractors.com. We'll send you all the information with no obligation. And uh, looking forward to hearing more from you guys later about how much you really love this program and how much it really saved you when you got hit by hail.